Did you know Nintendo is still running production code from the 1990s? And it works flawlessly. That's not luck. That's Japanese software philosophy at play. Japanese developers approach code like Toyota builds cars, carefully, sustainably, and designed to last decades. The mindset is called monozukuri, the art of making things. Code isn't just written, it's crafted. Features aren't the finish line. They're just the start of a long life cycle. Then comes Kaizen, the 1% improvement rule. Every commit, every day, the code gets just a little bit better. No giant rewrites, no tech debt sprints. One helper function today, one clearer variable name tomorrow. Over time, those tiny changes add up to legendary reliability. The results? Teams using this style report 60% fewer bugs in production, 40% less time on maintenance, and higher developer satisfaction. That's why Japanese software often survives longer than the frameworks it was built on. Another wow factor is Jidoka, stop the line. If a defect appears, development halts until it's fixed at the root. Even if it only affects 0.1% of users, the line stops. It sounds extreme, but it's why their production bugs are almost non-existent. They also apply principles from the Toyota production system directly to code. Build only what's needed right now, eliminate waste like half-done features or endless task switching, and focus on clarity that future maintainers will thank you for. Even their comments and naming show this philosophy. Variables aren't cryptic abbreviations. They're clear, descriptive, and often paired with comments that explain the business logic. Ten years later, the code is still readable. And finally, there's Wabi Sabi, uh, the beauty of imperfection. Code isn't expected to be perfect from day one. It's expected to evolve gracefully with each small change. Put it all together and you get systems that can run and thrive for decades. The lesson is clear. Software should be like a well-tended garden, not a throwaway sprint project. Maybe the real future of coding isn't faster frameworks. It's adopting a little more Japanese discipline.